Let's go, baby! Gold flying! Yo, what's poppin'? It's your boy TJ. Welcome back to another video. I'm bringing you the God video of all time. Yes, your boy TJ did a 140,000 FTMO account. And if you're from the US, that's 200,000. Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, I did the challenge. Yes, your boy has been doing it. I did it literally within. I'm not gonna tell you actually, you gotta watch the whole of the video. But if you are new around here, make sure to like, subscribe, and all that good stuff because you know I'll be dropping one video every three days to do with FTMO, to do with trading gold, loads of other stuff. So make sure to check out the channel after the video as well if you're into forex trading. And before I get into it, links in description if you get interested in VIP. There is a bot down there that you can click and get full access to the VIP. Also, we've got a Discord and a free trading group as well. Link in description. Description, do not want to miss out. But without further ado, ladies and gentlemen, girls, let's get into this FTMO video, baby. So, looking at the metrics on the FTMO, a £140,000 challenge account. Ladies and gentlemen, boys, girls, this is all legit. As I said on the screen right here, these are all VIP signals, which I will show you the analysis after the metrics. However, I need to just address something right here, right now. It's all about risk to reward when trading with FTMO. You know how it is. You can't trade in drawdown. If you actually see my metrics right here, minus 784 from an EUR Great Break Pound trade, which actually went all the way down. I was selling it. I will show you obviously the trades, but look at this. From minus 700 pounds all the way to plus 14,634 pound in one day, ladies and gentlemen, boys, and girls. Yeah, this is legit. Like, there's nothing to hide here. Obviously, I will show you the trades that we actually got, but minimum 10 trading days, and then we can go into the verification step, which I will be uploading on YouTube. So make sure to like, subscribe on that because I will be uploading it. Do you not worry. And as I said, all of these trades that I caught were in VIP. So as you can see, the max daily loss was 7,000. We actually got 4,000 in drawdown. Drawdown is important to not get an FTMO because the fact of the matter is this could affect your account massively. You know, you don't want to hit the max daily loss. That's number one. Any trader does not want to hit the max daily loss and you shouldn't be hitting the max daily loss if you're risk managing correctly. However, with this gold trade that I had, I had to hold it for the minus 4,000 pounds, which is absolutely fine. You know, that's about 3%. That's absolutely fine. 3% drawdown. My max is five in one day. So I was there, I was holding it. I believed in my analysis. And as you can see, right here you know win rate 71 percent the lots you know it's quite big lots but this account i was using a 10 pip sl for these gold trades so it's a 10 pip sl so every 10 pips i'm making one percent and as you can see number of trades seven i don't need to over trade i don't really need to over trade there's no fomo here i'll show you obviously the trade in a bit but there was no fomo i waited for the actual for the absolute beast trade to come alive and that's exactly what I did. Like, it's absolutely insane, the trade that I took. But we were selling off gold. And this is what I just wanted to say. We were selling at 1796 previously. Then Tokyo Session bull price back down. London bought it back up again, which I will show you, obviously. And then we got sales again. As you can see, at 1243, we were selling. And insane profits. Obviously, the extra USD minus 500 was because I closed my trades early. Because it actually said I had, you know, completed 14,000. But... Gold's very volatile, and then I had to absolutely get in a few extra trades quickly with gold. I knew it was dropping, so it was a quick in and out trade there to complete the challenge. But as you can see, £7,800 on extra USD profit, £3,300, £2,300, and two one thousands, And it's just absolutely insane, you know. We're buying, we're selling gold. It was an easy sell, which I will show you guys. But there's nothing to hide here with this challenge account. This is completely and utterly insane trading by myself i would like to just say you know i'm not trying to be big headed or anything but the, the sort of trading that i like to do is quality over quantity now if a trade isn't there to be taken then i won't take it you know i'll wait patiently i've been i'm more experienced now i've been training for such a long time where i don't get fomo and i don't rush into trades so i let them play out i let lower highs get taken out or previous higher highs I wait for the candlesticks to tell me on confirmations if I should enter a trade here and there. And that's exactly what you guys need to be doing. You need to go to like seven trades and I completed the account. And this is only because of the trade that I had marked up because I believed in my analysis. I believed in the trade that I took. 
and anyone can complete FTMO if they use good risk management, hit their trades obviously, but don't over trade, don't over leverage and all of this good stuff because in the end of the day, it can backfire and that is facts. It can backfire, you can lose your challenge and then that's it mate, they've taken your money. Which is something you don't want to be doing. So as I said, your boy TJ, check out the Discord, check out the VIP, check out the free trade, check out all of that. I'm gonna show you the chart analysis now and it's gonna be absolutely insane because I'm gonna talk you through obviously the high highs, the lower highs and how I channeled gold into thinking it's a sell and how I, my full process behind taking a trade, which we took all in VIP, as I said, up 25% this week in VIP. Let's fucking go, baby. So without further ado, let's get into the chart update, bang. So when looking at this gold trade, there is some things you need to take into account. Gold is very manipulative and will tap you out. And this is where you gotta play for your advantage. You gotta look at the resistance and the support. Resistance is the top and support is at the bottom. Now, we can see gold. You've gotta back test it. You've gotta get the market direction correctly. You can see gold. I've got my channels marked out here. Triple top, pull back, collected orders here and then couldn't actually go to the previous high. So sold off all the way down to the bottom of support at 17.63. And then we're going back on the arm trade. As you can see, touch 17.90, come back down, whipped everyone out of the support, and then bought price all the way back up. And this is where we get our sales, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. Top of the resistance, 17.98, couldn't actually break. We saw and we got entry. Now, this wasn't a trade on the FTMO. I'm gonna explain what trade we actually took. So now you can see, and I just want to talk about the time frame as well. This is the one hour, but it's also five o'clock on the third of May. Now, price gets brought down. Look at the time. During Tokyo session, price continues to get brought down. London open, what happens? Fake keeps the market. Price pulls back up to the upside, as shown right here. You see where I've got it marked out? What is it? What is this right here? As you can see, you've got the previous lower highs. It is found and collected orders, which has made it impulse to the downside. This was just a small pullback to the downside because we are bearish because of the 1798 top resistance rejection. So we're still going bearish. So we are expecting a pullback to the upside to then obviously completely go bearish. And that's exactly what happened. As you see, it touched the previous lower highs where price was consolidating and then absolutely rejected all the way to the downside, which we call in VIP, linking bio or link in description. But yeah, this trade was absolutely insane. And that's pretty much why we closed it at 1783 to 1782. I took it out early because I didn't need any more profit. And gold is absolutely and gold is absolutely on an uptrend because we saw it wick out previous lower highs at a 1761. Therefore, this was just a touch and a retest here. This was just a retest, yet we're selling into the market. You can sell on an uptrend, facts, proof right here. So you wanna keep into an account where it wicked out, out everyone and it's still on an uptrend. You wanna keep that in your mindset. You don't wanna you know, confuse yourself. And obviously after it touched here, it went to the upside and it flew up, it flew up. But the fact that Mary is with this trade, the sales that we caught on VIP, this, was the pullback here. That was my confirmation, that rejection. I believed in my analysis. I believed that it was still gonna sell off more. It wasn't just gonna hit the top of resistance at 1797 and come down to 17, you know, to 1783 and not just reject, you know what I'm saying? Like, as you can see here, 1783, price has not fully dropped. Then it pulled back, trapped all the buyers because people will be buying in if they're not smart enough. All the sellers will probably be tapped out and then you make your move, which is why it's patience. You've gotta get your trade on perfectly like the sniper entry is so crucial and obviously mark up marking a, a gold analysis like this will really help you because as, as shown if you get market direction wick out uptrend rejection pull back slight pull back here entries into sales and make a nice 70 to 100 pips profit on this with a tighter sell you are winning winning chicken dinner and then you can get for buyers here to go on the upside that is how simple it is all caught in vip you know i've shown you the trades i've shown you the ftmr account as well uh, on the meta trader this is all in vip link in description of course but it has been your boy tj if you want more videos like this make sure to like of course and let me know in the comments if you are in vip and call this trade and let me know in the comments also if you want me to release the verification steps and take the trades obviously i'm going to be taking everything live on twitch it's tjfx on twitch twitch.tv slash it's tjfx make sure to check me out link in description but it has been your boy tj much love on this video i hope all is well and stay safe stay safe trading let's go baby peace